Hello, how are we doing today? So, I'm Lincoln G. We find ourselves here with BFSC, Big Fish Small Camera Kevin, and the man, the myth, the legend, Mr. James Meigs, the man behind Meigs Jigs. And the reason we're here is, I don't know if you've been following BFSC, Big Fish Small Camera Kevin. If you haven't, subscribe, like. <laughs> but this guy, not having such a hot white fish season. So we get hooked this guy up with this guy to get on some whitefish. We're gonna show you how the Meigs works. Strap in, it's gonna be a bumpy ride. So James, Kevin showed up today with these two rods. Got a spinning outfit. Um, uh, I think it's dubious, and a, and a bait casting outfit. What kind of uh, setup are you looking at? What kind of setup do you want when you're fishing a Meigs? I I have no issues using the bait caster setup. Um, you can still get the nice proper bounce. I like a, a good 36, 34 inch rod. Uh, medium heavy, you yeah. get something with some backbone. Right. Right. Um, backbone, but you want the, st the 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 tip to be stiff enough that when you're shaking the rod, that lure is just bouncing and literally just just almost almost vibrating. There, I I, I like the uh, the Fenwick Elites. Um, any of the Fenwick rods are really pretty good for that. They have a fairly stiff enough tip where every action you do gets that tail bouncing. But it's it's stiff enough that you can really set the hook into it and, and, and get fish. those. You know, you're you're not fishing little little fish here. You know, yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is like Simcoe. This is yeah. you know, five six pound white fish. We're after you know, big ten, ladies. 10, 15 pound. Oh, here we go. Ten fifteen oh, pound fish on right? camera. So you can see exactly what you were just talking about. The way that your action at the rod would transmit to the jig. Pretty much. As opposed to just the, the tip of the rod absorbing all your action. Yeah. Yeah. I like to have my tip close to the water. You're, when you're bouncing on the bottom, the, the, the jig is on the bottom anyways. So it's not going to go down any further. Right. You're not looking for hits that your rod's going to go down. You're looking for something that's going to feel a little bit different. Your line's going to go slack. Your, your line's going to um, go to the side. And that's usually just them getting in there and, and, and picking it up. Set the hook, hook sets are free. So you've got to be really in tune with what the jig is doing. Yeah. And that is something I found tricky when I first started using the Meeks is that a lot of it is a lift bite. So you don't feel a tap or a tug. You just suddenly lose just, contact with your jig. Yep. And that's it. And yep. then you have to set and drive that hook home. Yeah, exactly. Um, that's why I can't stress enough with, uh, with braid as well. I run braid on all my rods. Um, every rod braid but I mean braid straight to the jig no I run braid to about an eight foot fluorocarbon lead okay they're eight to eight to twelve pound floral okay so I generally run there's another fish here coming oh, in another now fish coming up oh. oh still there oh no he took off he come back he bumped that now the trouble is sometimes you're doing the bounce and you're bouncing it so much that your the the hit looks exactly the way you're bouncing it. Right. So right. like again, it's you, you feel it, but sometimes they just they they hit it and it's gone off already. Sure. Sometimes you're lifting the same time they are. Yep. Up. <laughs> no. And that's how that's done, Kevin. Fish. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's a nice size fish right there. Wow. Let's see how it's all there. Always ring. Right. Yep. Right in the top corner. Very nice. Let's 
That's all too. One, man. So that's how it's done. That's how it's done. Nice <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> do it again, do it again. <laughs> what for James? Is it from me? One for James. Well, well, number I three. Mean, <laughs> <laughs>
if you keep doing this for a while and I don't get them to hit, then I'll you know I'll lift it up two inches, two two and a half inches. Pause it, hold it for a second or two, and then drop it back down, and then start the exact same thing. Right on. And say if either they're not on the screen, you, can, you know, rip it a foot or two and try to draw them back. Try in. to draw them back in, get their attention. It seems easy, Kevin. Yeah, it seems easy, isn't it? <laughs> So essentially we want it to be the head? Yeah, you, you basically want the head just to be pivoting as a, as a pivot point and you're basically just slapping the tail around and that jig will go around in circles acting like a like a feeding minnow. Seems and easy. That's how the action of the rod tip should be like, right? Yes, you, you're basically, it's, a, it's almost a vibration in the rod tip. There, you're, it's, you just let the rod tip do all the work and just let the rod tip bounce. But I'm not doing this. But so you're not, I'm not, you're laying not slapping slats, it. not putting the slack line into it. I'm not laying it flat. No, you're just letting the rod tip touch the you're, bottom. You're bouncing on the tension with the nose in the bottom. Yeah. yeah, and if you do that, you're going to feel a lot more of the hits. You feel a lot more of the hits, you're going to set the hook a lot more. You're going to get a lot more fish. And you'll catch fish more like you. Yeah. And not so much like Kevin. <laughs> Sorry, Kevin. Sorry, but not sorry. Sorry, but not sorry. I'm not much better than you. True confessions. <laughs> we'll see it down there. Good old head shaker. That's all right. Yeah, it looks like my size. Oh, yeah. Come here. Oh, boy. Uh huh. Before. Oh yeah? Yeah. Mouth is marked up. Kills, oh, yeah, kills yeah, yeah. right up there. So cash and release works. Done. Oh, I should be on this side. Okay, what do you want to say? Just I don't know, you goodbye. don't stop. Bye. Goodbye. 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 Thanks for watching. <laughs> Thanks for Please watching. Please like and share. BFSC Kevin, Meeks, the man, the jigs. Get some. Learn how to use them. The next few videos, you'll see this guy learn how to use some. I'll just disappear, fade into the background. I don't have to say anything. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Cheers. Thank you, thank you, thank Cheers. you for the ride. Thank you for keeping yeah. us. Cheers. I'll see you soon. Yes, man.